Remember the swing and remember the name. For at just nine years of age, Rory McIlroy from Hollywood is following in the steps of his golfing hero, Tiger Woods. He's all there. Straight in for Rory McIlroy. In his hometown of Hollywood, Northern Ireland, he was dubbed as the Boy Wonder because of his incredible golf skills as a child. His other nickname is the Celtic Tiger because he appeared to be the heir apparent to Tiger Woods as the game's greatest player. Who are we referring to? Rory McIlroy. In this video, we will look at Rory McIlroy's lifestyle, net worth, and beautiful wife. Number five, early life and golf career. McElroy was born on May 4, 1989 in Hollywood, County Down, Northern Ireland, as the only child of Rosie McDonald and Jerry McElroy. His father, Jerry, introduced him to golf at an exceptionally young age. Rory's parents made tremendous sacrifices for his golfing dreams to become a reality. Rory's mother would stay home during the day to look after her son and work at a factory at night to help pay for golf expenses. His father showed dedication by fulfilling two jobs as a cleaner and a barman. Rory attended St. Patrick's Primary School, where he began to get more serious about the sport. He became the youngest member of the Hollywood Golf Club at seven years old and spent most of his time honing his skills. When he turned eight years old, he started to perfect his technique by watching Nick Faldo's video on golf technique. At age nine, Rory nailed his first hole and won the world championship for the 9-10 age group bracket at the Doral Golf Resort and Spa in Miami, Florida. From Hollywood, North Ireland, Rory McIlroy. Hey! Rory passed his 11-year-old exams to gain entry to Sullivan Upper School. At the age of 15, McElroy was a member of the Irish team at the 2004 European Boys Team Championship and Europe's winning 2004 Junior Ryder Cup team against the United States on foreign soil in Ohio. In 2005, he became the youngest ever winner of the West of Ireland Championship and the Irish Close Championship. McElroy's record-setting play continued with back-to-back -back wins at the Irish Close Championship in 2006. McElroy also resisted the temptation to play collegiate golf when he withdrew his intent to take a scholarship at East Tennessee State University to play amateur golf in Europe. The decision paid off because at age 16, Rory shot a new competitive course record score of 61 on the Dunluce links of Royal Portrush Golf Club. Another victory in Milan moved McElroy to the top of the world amateur rankings. McElroy finally turned pro in September 2007. In his first event at the Quinn Direct British Masters, McElroy shot two over, which put him in a tie for 42nd place. In October, he finished in third place at the Alfred Dunhill Links Championship. Rory earned his first professional win at age 19 when he won the Dubai Desert Classic in February 2009. In his first appearance at the Major in April 2009, Rory finished the tournament tied for 20th place with a score of two strokes under par. On May 2nd to a course record and concluded with six consecutive scores of three. For a while, McElroy could not get over the hump at the Majors. In the 2010 Open, he finished second and third at the PGA Championship. There was also the famous collapse in the 2011 Masters. However, Rory's confidence would not waver, and in June 2011, he rebounded in a big way with a dominant eight-stroke margin of victory over second-place finisher Jason Day. His 16-under was a new U.S. Open record. He closed 2011 ranked number two on the rankings. In August 2012, Rory had another dominant display at the PGA Championship, winning by eight strokes, setting a margin of victory record for the PGA Championship with a birdie on the final hole. After a difficult 2013 in which he struggled with the equipment change, McElroy roared back to form in 2014 to win the 2014 Open Championship at Royal Liverpool by two strokes over Ricky Fowler and Sergio Garcia. He went on to win a second PGA Championship in a one-shot nail-biting finish with Phil Mickelson. In subsequent seasons, Rory has battled through issues that affected his play. For instance, in 2015, he had an ankle ligament injury. The top golfer in the world taking to Instagram announcing he has torn his ligament in his left ankle, an injury he suffered while playing soccer with his friends. And in 2017, a rib injury ended his season. How's your health? My health's good. It's not quite as good as it could be. What is it? It's an inflamed rib joint. So it's your CV joint connects your rib to your vertebrae. There's a little in inflammation in there. However, he has persevered in 2016 and finished top of the FedEx Cup by walking away with a $10 million bonus pool.
His consistent play in smaller tournaments led him to be ranked number one in the 2020 rankings, although John Rahm later surpassed him. In 2021, there was also bitter disappointment in missing out the Olympic bronze medal after losing a seven-way playoff for third place. Yet, Rory continues to live out his childhood dream one weekend at a time. Fun fact. While most kids fell asleep holding a teddy bear or doll, Rory's parents recall baby Rory falling asleep gripping a golf club. At age two, Rory was able to hit 40-yard drives. It left family and friends astonished. As the saying goes, you either have talent or you don't. And Rory McIlroy had plenty of it. You better recognize. Number four, earnings, business interest, and net worth. According to SportTrack.com, Rory McIlroy's earnings on the PGA Tour began in 2008 with a modest year-end total of $849,719. However, between 2011 and 2016, he earned nearly $28 million, or a whopping $4.6 million per year. Even in this past 2020-2021 season, McIlroy had seven top 10 finishes to earn $4.3 million. In total, the kid from Hollywood, Northern Ireland has made over $59 million in his golf career. It puts him number seven on the all-time money list and is the second most by a non-American player behind Vijay Singh. Rory is endorsed by TaylorMade, Nike, NBC Sports, Golf Pass, Omega, Optum. In 2022, Rory announced a new sponsorship deal that sees him becoming a brand ambassador for financial management company Workday. His tailor-made deal, which he signed in 2017, is worth $10 million per year for 10 years. Rory's Nike contract was extended in 2017 for 10 years and worth $10 million per year, having been worth $20 million per year from 2013 to 2016 when he was still using Nike clubs, balls, and bags. He is estimated to earn a ridiculous $35 million a year in total from his sponsorships alone. McElroy has reportedly joined forces with Symphony Ventures and Drive Shack. Drive Shack is an entertainment company that operates golf-related leisure venues designed to bring people together through competitive socialization. According to CelebrityNetWorth.com, Rory McElroy is worth a ginormous $150 million. Number three, insane training and daily routine. To become an elite golfer, Rory had to put in the work. The Hollywood golfer has undergone a transformation from that little boy with the wild curly hair to the ripped six-pack bulging bicep golfer who became the first ever in his sport to grace the cover of popular fitness magazine Men's Health. How was this transformation achieved? In autumn 2010, McElroy started working with exercise physiologist Dr. Steve McGregor and just a few months later, he won the US Open in 2011. So the lesson kids at home is no pain, no gain. Rory's daily routine includes a 5.30 a.m. wake-up call and light breakfast. Then he hits the gym at 6.30. At 7.30 a.m., he eats a larger breakfast with a recovery drink. Then at 9, he heads to the course for practice. Then he has lunch at noon. After an hour and a half, he is back on the course. At 4 p.m., he eats a mid-afternoon snack, and then he has a main workout from 4.45 to 6.30 p.m. Then he eats dinner and is in bed by 10 p.m. Wow, that is precise. Number two wild exotic car collection and mansions. One thing Rory McIlroy loves is fast and exotic cars. In 2013, he was pictured driving a black Ferrari F430. In 2015, McIlroy owned a white BMW i8. It was reported that the electric luxury supercar was a gift from BMW, and at the time, it was regarded as the fastest electric car in the world. Back then, the gullwing sports car was priced at a whopping $200,000. In that year, Rory bought a Ferrari F12 from his good friend and fellow PGA Tour pro, Ian Poulter. It is rumored to have cost him a cool $300,000. McElroy has also been seen in his Lamborghini Aventador worth $400,000 and a Range Rover Sport worth nearly $200,000. Yeah, Rory gets dizzy with the wheels at his disposal. McElroy also lives in luxury. In August 2017, McElroy moved into the golfing capital of the world. Jupiter. He bought an $11.5 million mansion in the Bears Club. It is a golf development that was founded by Jack Nicklaus, but Ernie Els previously owned this particular property. The massive property stretches over 12,800 square feet and boasts seven bedrooms and 10 bathrooms. A huge balcony at the back of the property overlooks a tranquil swimming pool. 
Inside, McElroy has everything a young multimillionaire could wish for. A recording studio, games room, gigantic pool, and a home cinema. Man, that is nice. Number one, charity work and beautiful wife. Back in 2013, McElroy established the Rory Foundation to support children's charities big and small around the world. In 2016, McElroy donated $1,142,906, including the entirety of his winnings from his victory at the Irish Open. His foundation, in turn, donated a total of $1.5 million to a variety of charities in the UK and Ireland. Although the foundation has closed in Ireland due to his move to the US, he continues to play in charity golf events, such as in 2020 when he teamed up with Dustin Johnson to win $1.85 million for the American Nurses Foundation during the height of the coronavirus outbreak. Rory's success on the golf course has garnered attention from the opposite sex. He shocked the world in 2014 when he broke off his engagement to tennis superstar Caroline Wojnarowski. After the public breakup, McElroy began dating the beautiful Erica Stoll. Erica is from New York, but later lived in Palm Beach. Rory had an interesting encounter with Erica when they first met in 2012. He overslept and nearly ruined the Ryder Cup miracle at Medina. Erica was the PGA employee who came to his rescue before police rushed him to the course that September morning. After a few years of dating, the couple got married in April 2017 on the grounds of Ashworth Castle, one of Ireland's top hotels. It included massive fireworks that cost an additional $67,000. Erica is a keen sailor, likes to bake cookies, and stay out of the spotlight. The pair welcomed their first child, daughter Poppy Kennedy McElroy, on August 31, 2020. Yeah! The Celtic Tiger Rory McIlroy has lived his dream life with success on the golf course, endorsements, exotic cars, mansions, and a beautiful wife next to him. Do you think Rory will end his drought and win a major in 2022? Do you think he can reclaim the number one spot on the world rankings? Let me know in the comment section. Smash the like button and subscribe to the channel for premium sports related content. Until next time.